can't say enough for Steve Hennel here, who runs your community college. It is probably the centerpiece of your education system in Cecil County. You have great schools in Cecil County. We try to invest our part from the state. We're one of only a handful of states that actually give money to counties for them to match school construction. That's part of our deal for equity within the school system. I can't say enough good things about Dave Rudolph, who was a former teacher. His wife dedicated her entire life to education in Cecil County, he grew up in Cecil County. He now works for the community college. He understands the value of education to any community. But I think every community wants to have an education system they can be proud of too. And that's the number one state priority. And we will continue to focus on that as we go through this year, next year, and the following year. Thank all the other legislators, E.J. Pipkin, uh, the minority leader. I'd like to compliment him and Mike Spiegel for losing more weight than any other two legislators. <laughs> Cecil County is the gateway to the rest of the state. I don't think that anybody in Annapolis, whether from Montgomery County, or in Georgia, Baltimore, and Rumble, doesn't appreciate the whole Cecil County place. It is a great county. It is the headwaters of the Chesapeake Bay. We love Cecil County. We do everything we can to support everything that Cecil County needs. Thank you very much.